Tucson residents say they've had enough of the problems plaguing the streets at night. Our Laura Barczewski is live outside Ballpark Village where two people were shot over the weekend. Laura? And it happened right here on Walnut, just outside Ballpark Village. And while St. Louis police say this was an isolated incident, bullets ended up hitting nearby vehicles. And it's exactly what residents and people who come downtown are worried about. It's just getting worse across the boards. Brandon Overton says as a downtown St. Louis resident, he's tired of gun violence. I mean, it's a it's starting to get a little bit out of hand as far as the shootings go. I mean, um, I've been down here about a year, year and a half, and it's just getting worse and worse. One of the latest shootings happened outside Ballpark Village. St. Louis police say a man was arguing with his girlfriend and another man tried to intervene. The men ended up firing shots at each other. One hit the man who tried to break up the argument and the woman was grazed in the leg. Several vehicles were struck by the gunfire and the suspect's firearm was recovered as he fled the scene. The male suspect has not been identified. A spokesperson for Ballpark Village said in a statement, safety and security is their top priority. Quote, while this incident did not occur on our property, our security officers were able to quickly observe and report it to the St. Louis police. St. Louis police are also dealing with another problem, unauthorized parties at vacation rentals and now even a hotel. Saturday night, the Embassy Suites called police to clear out a party. The downtown bike unit responded and assisted with clearing the halls of the hotel. Numerous people were leaving, were armed with weapons. The Problem Properties Unit will begin work with hotel management and ownership to hold individuals comp accountable for the actions of this disturbance and also the unauthorized large gatherings that were in place. St. Louis police are hoping this does not become a trend. Residents say the people doing this have no respect for their surroundings. And it really bothers me quite a bit sometimes, you know what I mean? Because these people, they have no respect for the building because they don't really live here. They're just here for a little bit of time just to have a good time. Both incidents are under investigation and the public safety director says as for the hotel party, they're going to work with hotel management to make sure they develop a strategy and a plan so this doesn't happen again. Reporting live in downtown St. Louis, Laura Barczewski, 5 on your side.